One day, a young curator found a scrap of paper and on it was a most amazing thing, amazing thing. Twas a plan for a time machine, craziest thing I'd ever seen, so he built it just to see what it could do. In a mighty fever, he went and pulled the lever. The machine puff smoke gave a bang, and a frightful roar, the frightful roar. The young man started quaking, then stepped back in amazement, and rubbed his eyes, for this is what he saw. He saw Julius Caesar, 
Oliver Cromwell, Elvis Presley, Marilyn Monroe, H.G. Wells, and Albert Einstein too, late for his own funeral, he saw Warhol, Walpole, Ho Chi Minh, Nightingale, Marx, again. That's Groucho. Pankhurst, Plato, Nero, Gandhi, Shakespeare, Aristotle, Chaplin, Churchill, Wilde, Lennon, Lennon, Curie, Mary. And Jack. Jack, who? Jack. The Ripper? Yikes. Yikes. Historical, hysterical, more like. The crowd leapt back, in a mighty fright. The man pulled the lever, they vanished out of sight, he sighed with relief that he'd sent them home at last. Home at last. The moral of the story is quite clear. History's fine when it ain't too near. History's place is clearly in the, clearly, in the, clearly, 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 clearly. For heaven's sake, give her a nudge. History's place is clearly in the past. Well, what do you expect from a robot? <laughs>